yeah, it's, I'm on my way to see Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2 with my brothers. I'm gonna go, I already got my turtle shirt. Passing 84. I had to, I had to walk of the way over here because I have to take public transportation. Yeah, hoping it's good. Hoping it's good. I'm really excited because, yeah. All right, so this is the movie show billboard thing we got. Don't usually go to this movie theater. When I go, I go with my wife, and it's one a lot closer to where we live. But the one where I'm going is, you know, a, a lot closer between for me and my brothers. So yeah, they got they got a show for Ninja Turtles. That's that's what we're gonna go see. We got X Men Apocalypse. They got uh, football games uh, in this one. They they do football games, uh, at least the World Cups or American Cups or something like that. They got uh, Neighbors 2. I want to go see that one. The Witch. That's uh, a Mexican movie. They're still, still promoting. It's just kind of like a knockoff of Knocked Up. And they got this uh, uh, retro showing for Toy Story. Oh, and they got tickets for The Conjuring. I want to see that one, yeah. Still trying to convince my wife if, if she wants to go see that with me. Or I might go see it alone. So, here's the first of my bros. This 69. What's up, this 69? Hey, bro. What are we going to go see? I think it's in the title anyway. Nah, you don't know what I'm going to name this. I'm pretty sure you're going to name it relative to what we're watching. <laughs> nah, it's going to be out in the back. Fine. <laughs> yeah, so. Hoping it's good. Yeah. Well, I like the first one. I just, I just hope uh, Shredder makes a comeback. I haven't seen anything. Uh, you I haven't seen be, the trailer? Like, like uh, what is it? Like a blind, blind view of the movie? I've seen the trailer. I just yeah. seen the first one where it just shows Roxanne and Beale. That's it. Nah, I've seen the second one. I He's in it. I, I skipped Spoiler alert. Shredder's in it. Yes. <laughs> so is Bebop and Rock City. I know those stories. So is April. Yeah. Casey Jones. Yeah, I didn't know about Casey. Daxter Stockman. I didn't know about Daxter. Krang. I heard about Krang. And spoil the whole movie for you. Damn it. <laughs> Turtles fight Shredder. Yes. Alright. So, waiting in line to get the tickets, so... Pay later. Point that at yourself. <laughs> I can't. I can't flip it. Fine. What's up, bro? What's up? What are we gonna go see? What? What, what are we gonna go see? Yeah. Nice. What'd you buy? I, uh, Show of the cups. Um, two cups. One for you. Donnie, that's you. One for you. Leo, that's me. That's right. That's right. Oh. The I cool. The Cooler Brothers in a single cut. I want one of those shirts though. Better get me one. <laughs> at, they're at Walmart. If I see them at Walmart, I get you one. Oh. Well, are you like extra, 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 extra large then? Oh no. I'm large. Hi. Hi. A moment to Chris. Yeah. A moment to what? Ah, gotta wait, dude. <laughs> Let me sniff this shit. Va a ser por la soda, wey. It's a moment to reflect. <laughs> Can't watch Ninja Turtles and not eat pizza. It's like a rule. Don't bring it, goddamn. Hey, bro. What do you think of Ninja Turtles? Yeah. Eat. Eat. What put it? Can't talk. Eating. Hey, what's up, YouTube? So, this is Vargas XX78. Uh, just got back from watching uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles out of the shadows, and uh, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Uh, I, I ended up liking it a lot more than the first one. Uh, the first one was good. Uh, at some moments, it caught the spirit of the turtles pretty well. Uh, the only thing was the design of the turtles. I, I didn't like the design. They looked too, too hulky. 
and uh, and Splinter Splinter was nightmare inducing. Splinter was was really really bad. The design they they went for with Splinter was was bad. That that thing was pretty bad. I I didn't like that at all. But uh, this one they, they tried to fix Splinter. Uh, he doesn't look that nightmare inducing. He still looks bad, but he does, they tried at least to fix him a little. Uh, the turtles, uh, it looks like they had some tweaks too. They they still look kind of hulkish, uh, these big green things. But uh, th this one fleshed them out a little better. All of them had a. Uh, they still have their character traits. Uh, Leonardo still trying to be the calm leader. Uh, Donatello's the tech guy. Uh, Raph is is impulsive and headstrong and, and Mikey's just like just Mikey <laughs> so uh, the character of the, of the turtles uh, at least the spirit of the turtles is, is there you know they they then fuck them up uh, as much as the Transformers I think uh, again Splinter Splinter is there uh, he doesn't he, he still looks bad but he doesn't look that bad uh, they downplayed Shredder a lot actually uh, they they don't explain why but there's there's a different actor he looks shorter and he kind of looks weaker than the tall uh, Asian guy they used on the first one. Um, now that one doesn't, I don't know, he, he felt like he really got downplayed. But the, the big introductions this time around is Bebop and Rocksteady. Uh, Seamus from WWE is Rocksteady and I don't know who the actor that played Bebop uh, is, but I, I think he did pretty good. I think Seamus did pretty good. Um, I was watching some behind the scenes stuff with no audio. And they motion captured the turtles and Bebop and Rocksteady, and it looks it looks good. It looks good. It looks a lot better than Transformers. Transformers just doesn't look right. But this one, uh, since they voice capture, uh, since they motion capture a lot, it it looks more real. Um, but yeah, I, I like that. I like that a lot. I like that. Uh, it, it it looks like there's even though everything's CGI, it does look like they're interacting with something. Um, Baxter Stockman is also Tyler Perry plays Baxter Stockman uh, as the henchman for Shredder. He's a tech guy that Shredder's using, and uh, Shredder's be uh, got captured, uh, and he was going to be transferred uh, because he was going to be sent to a high uh, maximum security prison. That's where he meets Bebop and Rocksteady, and uh, Baxter Stockman helps him out, and they do this transfer thing, and that's where then. Uh, he meets Krang, and Krang, the the brain part of Krang, I thought was pretty good. Um, I thought that was done pretty pretty nicely. And uh, the robot part, it looked it looked kind of like the one in the old cartoon, but uh, but the Krang part looked pretty cool. I, I kind of missed the voice actor that that played Krang in the cartoon because uh, the one they got, I, I'm pretty sure I've heard his voice before. But uh, he did good. He was just kind of hoping that he would do the and weird brain sounds that the original Krang would do. Uh, they ha it had the Technodrome, which was cool. I was kind of hoping that they would have a, a Vanilla Ice reference, and they do. Uh, they do have a, a brief Vanilla Ice reference. Uh, you've seen him in the trailers. Casey Jones is also in this. Uh, he's played by the guy that does Arrow, and. It, it, it looked good. Uh, he, he he was serviceable. Uh, I prefer the Casey Jones from the original movie. That one looked and and talked like uh, like Casey Jones. I imagine in my head would talk. Uh, this one was uh, this one. He he did good. Uh, he he's okay. I, I I have nothing against the guy. Uh, Megan Fox is back. Is April and uh, she again serviceable. I got nothing against Megan Fox. Uh, and she was. For what she did in this movie, she was pretty good. Um, I also, before the movie came out, uh, there's supposedly going to be a, a bunch of cameos from people that were part of the original Ninja Turtles movies, but I didn't really see them. And if they were there, I, I missed them. Uh, I'm going to have to watch the movie again when it comes out on DVD or Blu-ray uh, to see all the reference from the original cast members or people that worked on the Turtles. So, so yeah, it was still pretty good. Again. Um, the turtles have more screen time, so that's better. Um, I got no, really no complaints. It's 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 a good for what it is. It's it's a good turtles movie. Uh, so yeah, no no complaints. Uh, other than the horrifying Splinter look, and a little bit of what they did to Shredder. They really downplayed Shredder a lot. Uh, he didn't feel as menacing as uh, 
he kind of did in the first one, but but yeah, they they went with with a more streamlined shredder. So all in all, not bad. I I liked it. Uh, overall score, I would give it a nine. It's 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 worth a nine, I think. Again, uh, I will freely admit it's a lot of nostalgia go goggles. Uh, that's you know I was going into this with that, and also a lot of of the fact that I went with my brothers, and it's very rare that me and my brothers get together, and it's super rare when we get together to go see a movie. Uh, the last movie we got together to go see was the first Ninja Turtles, uh, which was really cool because all of her, uh, our families went to that. My, my dad rarely goes to the movie theater, and he went to, to see the first one. But uh, this time, it was all bros, and that, that elevates a lot uh, and adds a lot of points to this movie. So it's pretty good. Uh, a solid nine. I would definitely recommend you, if you like the Turtles, you'll enjoy this movie. Um, if you're too nitpicky, there you can destroy this movie. Because if you're nitpicky, you you're gonna find a whole bunch of faults in this. But if you go, you know, with your nostalgia goggles on, and you were already a fan of the turtles, you're definitely gonna watch this. You're gonna watch this, and you're gonna enjoy it. Uh, I think at least. But yeah, it's a solid nine. I definitely recommend it. Uh, I'm wearing my Ninja Turtles. I don't think I showed this one complete, but it's it's a uh, I, I, my wife got this for me at Walmart. And it's the Ninja Turtles. Uh, it's like a football tee, but uh, it's got Ninja Turtles in '84. Is the year that the Turtles came out. So yeah, this one's really cool. My my brothers were saying that they want one of these. So I don't know if I if I see it at Walmart. If I see some more, I'll, I'll pick one. I'll pick one for each one of my brothers. But I like this one. I, really, I thought it's, it's really cool. So yeah, if you got a chance, watch the movie. Highly recommend the movie if you're a Turtles fan. And uh, I'll record something real quick with my brothers because I want to get their opinion, their last opinion on the movie. So, um, bye guys. Alright, so we just got back from watching Ninja Turtles. What'd you think, bro? Yeah, that's not a good idea. <laughs> what I saw. In my opinion, uh, it was a really good movie. I enjoyed it. I. I would have to rate it better than I enjoyed the first one, mainly because this one had turtles on screen time a lot more than the previous one. So it really focused more on the bond of the brothers. It also had less of uh, Megan Fox, which is already a plus for me. I, I agree with my bro, uh, it has, the shredder is like built up that he's a really bad villain, but in the moment he has his helmet and his claws, uh, he, does, he gets like defeated easily, basically, uh, in case, you know, like spoiler free. And that's really disappointing, but uh, everything else, the, the fight with Krang, uh, the representation of the characters like Roxanne and Bebop and even Dr. Baxter are, are point on. I really like those. Uh, in my opinion, the movie was good. I think they could have done a little bit more with the story of Bebop and Rocksteady. They could have worked uh, a fight scene with the turtles. That would have been more better. Uh, in regards to the Shredder, they would have worked more with the suit. Yeah. The suit was a little bit more lame, and he actually didn't do nothing. He could have done a fight scene with the turtles, I don't know. He got defeated pretty quickly in a lame way. Other than that, the movie was cool and had more action than the first one. Uh, it had more uh, fighting scenes, but like I said, uh, they would have worked a little bit more with Bebo and Rocksteady with the turtles, and uh, the costume of the Shredder. I uh, didn't like the costume. Yeah, so while well, we go, uh, the other brother we went with had to leave early, but um, yeah, pretty good movie.